Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today is my TJ Maxx makeup shop with me video. I do these every Thursday and we found some amazing things and I know a lot of you guys love getting a good deal. That's why we go to TJ Maxx. We love to save on our makeup and also perfume. So in this intro here, I'm going to be partnering with Dossier to share their perfumes. So I have a couple here to show you if you guys are unfamiliar. I literally just discovered them in the past month and I cannot believe, like where has this been all my life? Because this is incredible. So basically Dossier is a perfume company and they make dupe perfumes for like your favorite designer fragrances and it's not with sacrificing the quality or anything like that because they actually are cruelty free vegan and they source their ingredients from very high quality products. Most of their scents are about $29 as well so it's very affordable because perfume can be so expensive. I love to smell good and scents just bring me joy so I have such joy in picking out my scent for the day but they can get up to that $100 range for a good perfume and that's that's a lot for me. So I think that this is awesome. Let me show you guys what this looks like. So basically this is the little box that it comes in and you get your perfume in there and there's also this little spray. Now what's great about this is let's say you order something and you haven't actually smelled it before so you have no idea what you're getting. You kind of just wanted to try it but you're not sure about it because you know scents can be different on everyone. So they give you this little mini one along with your big size so that you can try it first with this so then if this doesn't work out for you you can easily return it so that you're not using this product you're just using the little sample size so I thought that was pretty cool I love their packaging as well so it's just very simple it still looks very beautiful on your perfume tray if you're wanting to display it this one is the ambery saffron scent and this is supposed to be the dupe for the Baccarat Rouge, I believe it's called. I actually don't have this scent, so I have no idea how close this is, but it does smell like the Ariana Grande Cloud Perfume. And that one is also supposed to be a dupe for Baccarat, so I would say this is pretty spot on. These last all day on the skin, so the quality is definitely there, and I love that I'm putting like clean, good ingredients on my skin. I also picked out this one. So this one is called Gourmand White Flowers, and this is a dupe for Victor and Rolf's Flower Bomb, which is so crazy expensive. I can't believe this is $29. Um, again, 1.7 ounce of product in here so good this is something i like for the evening time and it smells spot on to flower bomb because i do own that one it's a favorite of mine the staying power is amazing as well again so i'm highly impressed with this brand so i really wanted to share that with you guys i do have a discount code for you guys if you want to purchase anything it is leah 10 for 10 percent off let me know if you guys have tried them before as well but you guys know I only show you guys and do sponsorships for the best of the best things I absolutely love and I had to share this with you because I know my TJ Maxx lovers are also going to love this because we love to find a good deal. So that is it for this intro. Let's go ahead and get into the shopping because we got some good stuff. We are back at TJ Maxx again. It's actually been a bit since I've been here. I didn't go over the weekend. This is the first thing that I saw. So cool. This is from the newer Barbie collection that Pure did. They did this one for the holidays and I just found two pieces from it. So this here is the highlighter in the collection. The signature illuminating highlight, it says this is what it looks like. It has kind of a golden um, pearl tone here and then a more pinky tone. It is really pretty. It's only $5.99 which is crazy. I did a whole video reviewing this collection. Um, I'll link it down below if I remember to um, if you guys want to check it out because I really like the collection and then I also found the blush palette. It's called Malibu Blush. So so cute. The packaging on this collection is everything so I didn't see the eyeshadow palette yet but I feel like it's probably on the way but these are such good finds. My store only had one each of them. So yeah, the Malibu Blush Palette, this is $9.99 and I would definitely say worth it. It's really pretty. You get six different shades in here, um, lighter tones to darker tones absolutely stunning so first find of the week is definitely a good one I also dug a little bit and found one Barbie lipstick too this one's in the shade innovator I feel like there's like a lighter nude and there's like a middle tone and like a red this one might be the middle one I can't quite remember 
um, but it's only $3.99 and these have gorgeous packaging as well. Insert a photo for you guys. So, so beautiful. I cannot believe this collection is here. Just if you see it, grab it because it's everything. And then we also have this from Stila. It has different packaging. It's a stay all day liquid lipstick. It looks like it has maybe a holiday packaging with the fun stars on it. This is in Beso. I know we have seen this color before, but you know, had to show the fun packaging. This is for $4.99, I believe. There's also a random sticker on it, but I'm pretty sure it's $4.99. Gosh, you guys, they have the Becca Mineral blushes as well. We've been seeing the shimmery ones, but I was hoping they would bring these back too, because these are a little bit harder to find. So these are the Mineral Blush in Flower Child, going for $9.99, and then they also have the shade Songbird. Both are beautiful. Would highly recommend this formula. So, so glad that we are able to see these again at TJ Maxx before they might be gone for good. So, definitely snag them if you find them because these are amazing. I'm also seeing quite a few things from Elf. A lot of restocks. I did see this Luminous Matte Makeup Primer that looked new. Um, this is going for $3.99. It says Lit From Within. They have this Lock On Lip Primer as well. It's a clear lip primer to keep your lipstick on. It's $2.99. And then um, they're restocking tons of the Dewy Coconut Setting Mist. This one's for $3.99. And then a couple of newer items I saw was this from Super Goop. It's the Bright Eyed 100% Mineral Eye Cream. We've always been seeing like their SPF sprays and stuff like that here, but I haven't seen much skincare from them. This is going for $9.99. It just has SPF 40 in it. And then they do have some new Pacifica things, including the Hardcore Happy. This is a perfume oil. This is one of my favorite scents. If you guys like vanilla and coconut, it's really good. I would definitely recommend. Um, the notes are vanilla, tuberose, coconut, and quartz, and this is $5.99. And then they also had this, which is the Use Light Energize Your Hustle. Also, it looks like a rollerball, too. I have not tried this one, but it has notes of lemongrass, lemon, and pineapple. And this one's $4.99. So, so this, the packaging is a little smushed, but it's from Becca. It's a mini size of their backlight priming filter with like the violet undertone. And this is going for, it looks like $3.99. I guess it's called First Light, not Backlight. The other one's Backlight. That's more of like the champagne color. But yeah, this is a mini size that they had. I see quite a bit of new Stila last week, but it looks like they did restock some of their like glitters, suede mats, and also the satin. So, um, definitely be on the lookout for those I won't go too in depth since we see those all the time but it looks like they did restock if you're looking for it all right so the next store we went to they actually have more Stila foundations I'm pretty sure we saw this before like one shade but it's the hide and chic fluid foundation still super curious about this one they have the shade light medium one this is $12.99 and they also have a fair one and a light one so I'm assuming we'll be seeing a lot of these in many different shades in the future. I did find two more Becca lip liners. We have the shade Mood and also Fun here. Some deeper tones going for $4.99 again. We also have quite a bit of perfusion stuff showing up so I wanted to quickly go over that. We have a sparkly nine shade palette from them which has these shades in it. It's very colorful. This is for $5.99. We also have the Bubbly which is very warm toned pinks same price and another sparkly this is a huge set from profusion it has the sparkle pigments it's called so six piece of pigments plus the adhesive and a little brush to apply them that's kind of fun I never use pigments anymore it's just a little too messy for me this is for $6.99 I see they made a whole little elf section here and over here, I see a new Smashbox product. It's the O Gloss Intuitive Lip Gloss. I believe this one changes to like your pH or whatever on your lips. Mine always just turns to pink, I feel like. This is for $9.99 for that. Here they have another new little set from Stila. This one is their A Stellar Duo. It has the Huge Extreme Lash and also their Magnum Triple X Mascara. Never heard of the second one from them, but I have tried the Huge Lash and I really like it. This is going for $14.99 for the two full sizes. Pretty neat little set. I did see in the skincare this product from number seven. We never really see their stuff here very often, but it is the Protect and Perfect Intense Advance Serum Activating Pads. They have 10%, I think, glycolic in them to brighten the skin. This is going for, it looks like $6.99. We also have this Dry Bar Detox Dry Shampoo. Their dry shampoo is seriously one of the best if you have super oily hair. So they have a new scent called Vanilla Bourbon, which sounds really good. This is going for $14.99. I bought one, I think, a couple years ago that was like coastal 
coastal surf or something like that but i have not seen this one yet they do have this new perfume set from Marc Jacobs, which is super cute. It's the Daisy Oh So Fresh. It has like these little balloon letters on it. Absolutely adorable. This is $69.99. It looks like it comes with the 2.5 ounce spray plus some extras. They also have this cute little perfume set from Marc Jacobs, the Daisy perfume set. So this is going for $29.99. They're .33 ounces in each. They have the original... There's Daisy Love, and then I'm not sure what the other one is, but super cute little set here. All right, we found another Makeup Revolution Pet Shop palette. We saw this gold one last week, and now they have this one, which is the licorice version. So this one is kind of more purple tones in here. <laughs> A lot of you guys were surprised I didn't pick it up last week, but I find that when I do buy the Makeup Revolution stuff, I'm not really that impressed with it. I just never use it, even though it is really cute. But I did want to share there is a new one being found. And I wanted to share these two Becca lip liners as well. Finding even more shades here in Energetic and also Chill. They also have this Profusion palette in Golden Knife. It's an 18 shade palette. So lots of Profusion here. This one is $5.99. And there's also this one from Profusion, the Hollywood palette. This is for $6.99. There's so many. That one is humongous. There's also a bunch of these, which I think I mentioned before, the Elf Sweet Tooth Sponge Trio. It might have been a different one that I saw uh, last week, but this one has three different sponges from them. Um, $4.99, they are latex-free, so it has this one, there's this angled one, and then a mini one. All right, next day at the stores, then we have here a new Bobbi Brown palette. We always see the same one from them, typically. I don't even remember the name, but this is a new one. It's called the Stonewashed Nudes Eyeshadow Palette. And let's see here, it's going for $24.99. I know the Bobbi Brown stuff is usually pretty pricey here, so it's probably about half off, but I'm excited to see a new palette from them. I'll definitely insert a photo for you guys. I'm also seeing a new item from Milk Makeup. It looks like maybe just one so far, but it's the Sunshine Skin Tint. I believe this is a product that they redid um, and came out with a new version of it. So this is the older version. Um, this is in light. It's going for $9.99. It has the little poof it looks like on top or is that a roller ball reading the description it does say it is a sheer buildable natural coverage infused with mandarin avocado grape seed and olive oil probably won't like it for me because i do like more medium to full coverage but really cool to see a new milk product this also looks like it might have been used too which is really unfortunate Let's move on to another new Stila product. We've been seeing so much from them lately. I just saw that they came out with something new and exciting. It's a camo palette, so I haven't seen much new from them lately, so that's really cool. But this is a one-step correct eye correcting and brightening serum. I've never seen this from them. It's for $9.99 here. They have a couple of them in stock. Um, it just says it is a triple swirled cocktail of peach tones that primes, erases, dark circles, brightens, and hydrates. So basically a corrector for your eyes before makeup. It seems kind of promising. And again, that's $9.99. Behind that, there's a bunch of the shimmer and glows. So they did restock a ton of them. It looks like a bunch of them in Kitten, Grace. Here's all the shades. We've seen these all before, but I just wanted to share. Over here, it looks like they added a bunch of those pure lipsticks. We have gone over those already. And I'm seeing a new Juicy Couture item. We saw their lipsticks a couple weeks ago. There's actually still a couple here. But this is a lip luster. It's actually in really large packaging. It says that it's in the shade Like Famous. Only $3.99 for this. I'm so curious if any of you guys have tried um, the lip stuff from them, what you think. I think it's so cute. I do like Juicy. I just ordered some stuff from the Juicy Couture and Forever 21 collection that they released. I should be getting that this week, but this looks interesting. We have new Jouer. I always love finding new Jouer here because I do really like the brand, although I feel like the stuff we find is kind of older stuff, but um, hopefully we see some new things like this Pearl Lip Enhancer. It's a tinted one. I might pick this up because I absolutely love their original lip enhancer. It's one of the best lip balms. It actually went like pretty viral on TikTok not that long ago. Um, this is $3.99 in Rose Pearl, so if it's a little bit of a tint, I think I'm really going to like it. And then they also have these, which are also from Jouer, the Luminizing Liquid Highlighter. I've never heard of these from them. I'm still waiting to see if their powder highlights show up. I know we've seen them in like sets before, but I want individuals. <laughs> this is in Golden Light for $4.99. Also, we have a Longwear Eye Brightening Primer. This looks really nice. 
I think it's just in one shade. This is $4.99. We stocked some of the lip toppers and tan lines. These are just super sparkly glosses. $3.99 for that. I don't think there's any new shades. Champagne gold. And then tan lines again seem to be the only two. Plus the Jeffree Star one is restocked. So I found this little mini cream eyeshadow from Jouer in the shade Chiffon. This is going for $2.99 from them. This looks like a new shade in the Becca Ultimate Lipstick in nectar it looks like a bright raspberry it's going for $5.99 they did have a couple more shades up here but they look like some deeper tones that we have seen before I did restock at my store too one of the Lancome setting mist I'm hoping to see more Lancome too in the future because I've only seen a couple of things from them like makeup wise but this is going for $12.99 over in the skincare we have some new Kula sunscreens for summertime this is the mineral body sunscreen fragrance free sheer finish with SPF 30 this is going for $7 99 it does have the expiration so um, you would definitely have to use this pretty quick um, it does expire November 2021 and then this is the mineral sunscreen in tropical coconut so that one's basically the same except it is scented same expiration date and it's $9.99 they have a really large Erno Laszlo kit and it has like a sensor on it even but it says with love Dr. Laszlo the best sellers set so this comes with their eye serum mask their cleansing oil and sea mud uh, cleansing a bar. Apparently Marilyn Monroe used to use the skincare line. I think she did use the cleansing bar too. Um, it's good for acne prone skin. And they also have the skin supplement, a night cream, and a skin vitality treatment. I'm assuming these are like smaller sizes. Um, it looks like oh, some of them are one ounce, so two ounces. Some of them are full size. This is only $34.99, which is really cheap for this because this stuff retails for a lot more. So that's kind of a cool find. Seeing some soap and glory in the body care section. They have a ton of these um, body washes. We don't really see their stuff that often, so I always like to point it out when I do find it. But literally, there's like 10 of these here. It's the cooling body wash from them. Um, so it's, it says it's their original scent, which I love. It smells so good. And it's going for it's only $3.99. That's awesome. So it's supposed to be a cooling shower gel. We also got some mini hand foods here. This is also one of my favorite hand creams. Um, if you guys have dry hands, this is amazing. Plus you get the awesome scent. But this one's actually in Sugar Crush. I don't know if I've tried that one. It says sweet lime and vanilla. And it's $2.99 for that little guy. Back at the next store. And I was on the hunt for this because I love when I can find like the full collection. And we found the Pure and Barbie eyeshadow palette. So now we have the highlight, the blush palette, and this plus one lipstick. Glad to see if there's any more. But this is what it looks like. Like I said, I do have a video on this one already. It's going for $12.99. Super pretty. Love the formula and it's super fun packaging as well. And a couple more pure Barbie items. Just seeing the whole collection here. Um, they have the CEO lipstick, which is the red shade. Still looking for the nude one. That one's personally my fave. And then they actually have a gloss here as well. We haven't seen this yet. So we have girl gloss. This is for $3.99. I just can't believe how cheap this stuff is here. The Barbie collection, especially since it's such a new thing. Then here is one more piece from the collection, the Lit Mist. It's their setting mist, but it's really pretty. It looks like kind of a vintage perfume bottle that you like spray. So cool to see this here as well. It's an illuminating one, and this is only $7.99. That's kind of what it looks like on the back. So pretty much we've seen almost the whole collection except one lipstick there's a couple more glosses there's like a mascara set i don't know if that will show up um i'm thinking that's pretty much all of it I did also add this elf eyeshadow palette the holy smokes mad for matte palette it's really pretty kind of reminds me of the urban decay wild west this is for 3.99 i feel like they're always restocking mac lipsticks and adding new shades i can never keep up but pretty sure we haven't seen this one yet at the stores because it used to be one of my favorites it's snob this is one of like the first mac lipsticks i bought it's kind of a light pink i probably wouldn't wear it these days but i used to wear this literally every single day and it's going for 7.99 and they also had this cute little philosophy set. It's called the Amazing Grace Ballet Rose Little Minis. So it has the shower gel and also the lotion. It's going for $7.99. Another one of those milk foundations at a different store. And this time they had the shade Fair. But they literally just have one of each. But sometimes my store gets like one shade. And then eventually in a couple weeks they get a bunch more. Because now I'm seeing a bunch of the KVD True Portrait in the deeper tones. If you guys are looking for this one, they have tan and deep as well right now. So lots of these. This is $9.99. 
I did want to point these out as well from Kula. They have the sunscreen sprays. I have these and I love them. They're so easy just to throw in your bag, especially if you're going to the pool or something. Um, but we have the classic in guava mango for $12.99. Also pina colada as well. And those do have the expiration on the bottom, so you could totally use it for this summer. We do have some new e.l.f. single brushes as well, which I wanted to point out. We haven't seen much new brushes for a long time. Usually if I see something new, I'll show it. Um, but it's the Precision Sculpting Brush for $3.99. And then they also have this one, which is their airbrush stipple. I typically use these type of brushes for like cream blush. This is also $3.99. They have some really good brushes, especially their precision line is really nice. There's also another dry bar scent being found too. So we saw that one, the vanilla bourbon. They also have the bubbles and berries scent, which is champagne, I believe, scented. So cool to see those. Like I mentioned, I do really like those dry shampoos. And they also have this collab one. I know these are, you can find them at the drugstore, but they have a fruity one. I've never tried this one, so let me know if you guys like it. It's $3.99. I'm always looking for a good dry shampoo that doesn't like dry my scalp out, because my scalp is very dry already. Came over to Marshall's for the last stop of the day, and we have another new Stila set here. So this is the Kitten Bliss Eye and Lip Set. Very pretty. It matches the same packaging as that liquid lip that we saw. So this must have been from last holiday. It looks like a full-size eyeshadow in Kitten, a deluxe size glitter and glow, also Kitten Karma, and a full-size lip gloss in Kitten as well. I was wondering what that was. It looks like a highlight. I'm sure you could use it as one, but technically I guess it is a eyeshadow. But this is going for $14. $19.99 and they also have this set too the two lucky stars eye set that comes with uh, glitter and glow in kitten a mini size again and then a full size smudge stick eyeliner in stingray I do love their smudge sticks they're so good so some more new Stila which is always exciting they also have a, another shade in the Stila double dip which is basically a mini suede shade on one side and a glitter glow on the other in blackout this one actually might be a totally new shade because I've never seen this one before but it kind of sounds like a good one this is going for $7.99 also they had this new liner lip liner from the lime crime velveteens in the shade plastic which is hot pink totally reminds me of like a Barbie color this was $3.99 but I wanted to mention since we haven't seen that shade yet even though we have seen a lot of those they also have this from Clinique it's called the almost lipstick in black honey so I know black honey is like one of their best sellers it's like a plum color but since this is called almost I'm guessing it's very sheer it sounds pretty though this is $7.99 all right so that is it for this week's TJ Maxx shop with me video it was a really good week we found so much stuff although I didn't really buy much I only bought one thing which I will show you but I was just so shocked to see all the pure Barbie stuff that was definitely the highlight of the week I think I found pretty much everything um, that I saw some others finding like on Instagram I'm always stalking what other people are finding to know what to look for except I did see some people are finding the first aid beauty concealers as well but I did not see that this week and all I bought was the Jouer pearl lip enhancer I had to see what this is all about so it does look like this it's just their lip enhancer in this uh, darker packaging and then it's like a rosy tint I have a little bit of gloss now I guess I could kind of put a little bit of this on instead of just swatching it on my hand but I love their lip enhancer it makes your lips look so plump so it just offers a slight color not a whole lot still smells like rose I was a little bit worried with some of the joy stuff there is a little bit on the old side but I mean this still smells like rose it smells good to me and yeah that's pretty much it for this week's TJ Maxx video I'm so curious to see what you guys found as well let me know in the comments down below and also don't forget to check out dossier I will have them linked in my description box as well as my coupon code but yeah thanks for watching I'll see you guys in my next video bye guys